stage is set and the glittering prize awaits one of these two teams. But which one in the 2022 FIFA World Cup final? And we're with you every step of the way. Live coverage here on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Portugal, and they take on Belgium. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. The starting players for Belgium. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Toby Alderweireld plays with Jan Vertonghen at the back. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Yannick Carrasco on the flanks. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And this confrontation is underway. Takes on the shorts. Well, I... It's been a long and winding road to the final for Portugal. It's worth remembering that they finished second in the qualifying group. They had to go through playoff matches against Turkey and North Macedonia just to get to the 2022 finals and this past month has been challenging as well but they're here and they have a well-earned track record as winners well you're absolutely right but i think they've got better and better as the tournament has worn on they've got a great understanding of what's required of each player on the pitch they're good tactically they've been fit and i think they've got every chance of being the world champions here but they're gonna have to play well Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. And once again, they get the ball rolling. Let's find out if Belgium can react to this setback. Joao Felix. He must finish. And a goal. I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, let's just take another look at this through ball by Ronaldo. He gets the timing absolutely right. And it's a top-class finish from João Felix. He just hits it with such power. That's a brilliant goal. So 
so the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Number 11, Tremendous ball played through. And a goal! What a magnificent display. It's such a one-sided contest here. Well, as you can see again, Fernandez plays a perfectly weighted pass beyond the defenders, and Ronaldo finishes it with so much quality. Just look how much power he hits this with. It's a top-class goal. So the action continues, and Portugal very much bossing the proceedings here. Let's fly here! Well, as you can see, this catches everybody by surprise. Look where he is when he strikes it. That's a great goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Ronaldo. Oh, fine stop. <laughs> and now the delivery. No nonsense clearance. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. And that's a corner. Who can they pick out? It might still be problematic. But it looks so threatened. And in with a real chance. That is a long way off target, Stuart. Well, he looked in control, but in the end, the shot was wayward. That's a poor finish. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. And there is the goal to make it a hat trick. Excellence in finishing, there for all to see. Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball is in the back of the net. Terrible defending. Oh my goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Tremendous block. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Well, that's a free kick he'll want to forget all about. Well, just look at the reaction of his teammates. That's a real waste. That's a very fine piece of tackling. And it's teed up for Ronaldo. Well, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. And Ronaldo takes on the shot. Well, a long distance effort and a highly respectable one, Stuart. Well, he surprised everybody, including me. It's a decent effort, you have to say. And there the attack ends for now. An example of how to press. 
Good tackle, take it away. Well, he missed the targets and then some. Wide it went. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready and now they will make the personnel change. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. What a powerful effort, but just wide. Well, as those stats tell us, their attacking play today has been exceptional. Defenders have come out at the right time, midfielder completely dominated the game, and the front player's movement has been excellent. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Carrasco. Perfect tackle. And Ronaldo takes on the shot. Oh, goodness gracious me. It's a special, special goal from miles out. Well, look at the replay here because they don't come much better than this. He hits it so sweetly. What a goal this is. Ronaldo it's still alive well, the injury will mean a stoppage the referee going down that road so treatment can be administered now so a drop ball here following the stoppage You don't want to lose the ball in that position. Thwarted by the post. Well, no damage done. The high press was very much on. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. No nonsense clearance. Well, I still can't believe that didn't go in, Derek. What an incredible save. Well, he couldn't quite hit the target, Stuart. Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. Oh, he's lost possession. Cristiano Ronaldo with acres of space. A routine save. Fernandes. Now with Ronaldo, the supporters want to see him have a go. A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Well, here's the replay and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. the ball away he's got to have a go here oh good work by the keeper trying to deliver it accurately well still an issue here and in it goes a perfect header exactly what they were looking for When you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. Goal! 
and the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Joao Felix. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, he wasn't going to waste this chance. 1v1 against the keeper, and he slots it away with great confidence. That's a good finish. Shot happy here. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Perfect challenge. And now passing it through. Good stop from the keeper. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Not the best clearance. Takes the shot. Well hit with power and almost the right precision. Now, what's the keeper playing at? Oh, a goal! the goalkeeper would like to forget all about well as you can see he's made a real mess of that what was he doing that's a poor mistake and it's cost them a goal Mertens. They've lost it. Joao Felix. And he's only gone and made it a hat trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance! Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Cristiano Ronaldo. He's in here. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, here it is again. Ronaldo finds exactly the right pass behind the defenders and a really powerful strike from João Felix. Great technique. That's a top-class goal. Tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. So now a corner. Go, 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 go. 
And over it comes. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Well, not quite the result he was hoping for with that shot. Close, though. Thirty minutes to go, then. He takes aim and effectively parried away by the keeper. And the corner has been given. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. And the keeper did more than enough. Is this the moment? Safe, but still a chance. And he clears it out of harm's way. Keeper had work to do. And time for the change now. Corner kick played in. And still dangerous. Well, nothing untoward happened. Bruno Fernandes, and a long way out. Well, decent save there. And there's the delivery. And a headed goal it is! Right on cue! Well, here it is again. It's a well-delivered ball into the box, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Away again, this game very much over as a contest. And Ronaldo takes on the shot, didn't fool the keeper. And now the delivery, the clearance wasn't decisive. And take it away, 20 minutes remaining. He'll try his luck here. Not the easiest of situations for the keeper. He's driven in the corner. And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender's just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. Passing high, and they have the ball again. And a fine stop. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, the danger is still there.
Well, here's the replay, and you can see why the manager is furious. It's just really poor play, offering up possession far too easily in a dangerous area. And at this level, if you keep doing that, you're going to get punished. It's just not good enough. And the ball's gone. Oh, what an opportunity. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. And over it comes. Not away completely. What a performance! Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. Sloppy there, Bernardo Silva. He's in with a chance. And the keeper more than equal to it. <laughs> Who's going to get on the end of it? Now he must get it out of there. Went in strongly to win the ball. Whatever way you look at that, it's been squandered. And top notch as well as brave goalkeeping. Well, he comes off his line at just the right time. He read that brilliantly. And a long way out. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. So the corner played into the box. This could be dangerous if he's not careful. Well, since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. But a second foul after the first one, and so no advantage there, free kick. Not to be advised, giving the ball away there. And the counter looks on here, options available. They need to get bodies back. And a goal this time, applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace, the keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. Well, it could be on for him here. And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. Trying to deliver it accurately. Not all that convincing defensively. Well, you've got to classify that as a poor attempt. A long way wide. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution.
Alderweireld. Oh, pressing really high. Belgium unable to retain possession. Long way out this. And now it's all over. We've witnessed history. Portugal have won the World Cup for the first time. Well, they've been kings of Europe. Now they're kings of the world. And I have to say, Derek, they fully deserved it. They were great today. Portugal, the world champions. And this is finally Portugal's time. Fully deserved. Best team in the world. Well, you have to give credit to the coach. He's been excellent, but so too the players and these fans. It's absolutely magnificent for them.